Hello everyone, K-Dub here, and this is the second round of the K-Dub Tour at Bay Hill. So we're using the second pin set on the course, and now I've just changed the conditions slightly. The wind speed's going to be medium, which is what it was in the previous round, but the wind direction's coming from the opposite direction, the south. And we're going to have fast and firm conditions for the fairways and the greens. It's going to be in the morning with light clouds, crowds are up. And we're playing from the back tees. So it's going to be a little bit different. And in the first round, we had a 65, a 765, and that was with a triple Hello bogey. There, and a so we're going to try and prevent PG that from happening again. Here. Hope you're doing great. In Looking other words, don't tin cup it on a bar five. Score you can post here at All right, so it's wind's coming from the Bay south Hill. this time around, Let's so go. this is going to play downwind. I'm going to try and fade it just a smidgen. Yeah, I think three wood's fine. Uh-oh, pulled it. That's going to need to get lucky. And it did. Perfect. And this one is around 180 yards to the pin. I was playing EA earlier, so I have to remember that the controls are different. All right, so this looks like it could be just fine. It's got to not push it, I think. We didn't. We pulled it left. Ooh, can we get a bounce to the right, That's please? That's the miss, though. Safe now we're the green. right in the middle of the green. Yeah, here we go. And we have birdie. a putt for birdie instead of hitting out of that bunker. Or hitting it from the rough out there. Uh, and possibly having to hit a funky shot. All right, so we have a big breaker here. We're going to have to play it way out here. I'm not sure how much. This looks pretty close. Now we just got to get the speed. Uh, it sort of lagged a little bit there, but we played too much break there, there and that's all right. right in. I would rather have that happen the than miss it on the low side, even par. which is, is cool. the amateur side. Heads up. Wind's going right to left on this one. Yes, it is. This is going to be... I don't like this hole initially, so this is going to be fun. So we're going to hit a five hybrid. We're going to have a big draw here. That was a much better swing. Uh-oh. Well, it missed the bunker, well, but that doesn't hit help all. at all. Here's so I'm going to go with the flop. I'm going to right stick down as much as, well, not as much as I can, but a lot. And then I'm going to right stick it down for some spin. And then we're going to adjust this. So if this flies off the club head, this is going to go over. And I gotta hit this relatively straight, or else it's gonna take some of the distance off. There we go. That's. And wouldn't it be nice to save par here? I would have liked to have it about three feet, three or four feet closer, but it is what it is now. All right, let's see if uh, I can get this just right. Oh, Good. we got it. All right, well done. Good car save there. A little bit unfortunate with that bounce. It could have bounced forward even. more than left, but and it bounced left more than forward. So on the third. We're playing it safe here. I'm going to try and hit a nice little baby fade. That being said, I've got the pull with these right now. Swing. Fine swing. Thankfully, I played it enough to the right. All right. This is about 120 yards or so from the pin. Mm, downwind. Five miles per hour. I'm going to say that this is what we want to do. Get some spin on this. That's it. Thank you. Good one. Hold high. 12 feet to go. 12 feet. That's a little bit above average when it comes to a wet shot. Break. Oh. It didn't. And this next putt. I par. can't believe it. And now a look at the scorecard. So we're playing you steady Eddie right now right at even par. And teeing this one up on the fourth. That would be good for my customary fade. Put those trees there. Oh my, you caught that one. Look at it go. 
perfectly in the fairway. Hmm, could I make it to that front? I think I could. Well, not if I hit it like that. Oh, it missed the bunker. Okay, third shot. I guess if you're looking for any type of good break, that would be one. That, and that. Maybe not quite that much. That was very good. Going through with the chip. And this one's for Bird. What I see All a right, lot of moving forward. in competitive when Let's you're at the lower levels one under par. is Let's see what the we players do don't on the play fifth. the run out. Uh, they sort of just take the default that the computer Uh, swinging like silk. They take the default that the computer plays, Setting and then they just sort of go with it. Yards. And you can't really do that. Uh, okay. Be a little baby fade here against the wind, hopefully. That was better timing. Come on, get right. I'll take it. Really well. I'm not, and, and this is common. This putt is I also nine see feet people away. really trying to go for the flag stick. And, and it's like, just get within 10 to 15 feet and give yourself a chance. Um, because if you go for the flag sticks each and every time, and you hit a bad this shot, so far. that was Boom, an easy you putt that one and that's back Two in a row. Birdies. And we could get aggressive here. But Short if you give, give yourself... Let's say you short side yourself. Um, that's where you hit the ball and it goes on the side of the pin and now you have less green to work with. That should be fine. Yikes. Here's our second shot It's okay, shot I'm, gonna, I'm gonna play like hole. a three shotter now. It doesn't even matter that it went in the first cut there. Well, that was that's going to be net straight. But when you short side yourself, now this you have a tough third. chip. And even if you hit like a super flop, like I like to do, it's a tough shot where you can come up short and then you got another tough chip. Um, so it's one of those situations where just aim like 10 feet to the left and hit it to that spot. All right, so we're going to play this a little bit lower. That's gonna be left. And a little long. That one dialed in, didn't you? Now you've got. But you know what? Foot seven putt. feet, so that's a pretty good wedge shot. Quite a bit of break on this seven footer. That's a chance. That's going. Alrighty. Nicely done for the birdie. So three in a row. Uh, but I see a lot of little mistakes and that are made currently sit at, at three the under par. Uh, lower levels in okay, competitive hole, that we got a tailwind to deal you, with. You don't see at the higher levels. Hmm, I think I should probably hit a six. Good swing. Come on, bounce to the right for us. That's, That's fine a safe shot. right there. This is a very, very long putt, but I have confidence 35 in 35 feet, up a foot. I gotta play quite a bit of break here, so I'm gonna play it up here. Oh, that needs to go. Oh, it did. Right by the hole. I just played a little too much break. Oh, All right, here is a look a at our par putt. Okay, very good. Keep you at three under. Also, when you get to the higher levels in competitive, they don't miss putts. This one's clocking in at a par four. Uh, and that gets really frustrating because I have a lot of putts that flip out or go over the edge. That's going to be a net straight. No problem. 
And it wasn't that far off. Steve's job. Okay, this is about 160 or so to the pin. We could make it with a with an eight. Oh, that's a beauty. Stay there. That's Hold high. That's what we're trying to get. Here we have a 17 foot putt. Way up here. Oh, I don't think I played it up enough. I did. Right by the hole. It just went too. It just and went too far. For the par. Uh oh. This one's tracking. Woo! All Stuck right, in the there. side door. For the par. If that EA would have lived out. <laughs> or and after that one, you're three duck, under. A duck slice. This a par four. I'm going to actually try to keep it close to that bumper. And not hit it in the bumper. Oh my goodness, Hopefully. just annihilated. Oh, just that. carried it, so we're good. And this one's around 175 yards out. All right. End of the win, though. Time for the high fade, I think. For the smidgen spin. I don't like hitting the shot, but I want to hit. Oh boy, sit. Well okay, done. That's one. another green in regulation under your belt. This one's eight feet away. Thankfully, because it was a fade slice, it stopped pretty quick. Or else it might have been short. Break. Nope. Ooh. It and doesn't break that much, part, apparently. Uh, uh, keep you at. Three under, three under after nine, so very We've similar to what we were right doing in the previous round, with the exception that I haven't triple bokeyed yet. <laughs> but we got time. We got time. Let's hit this three wood and see where it ends up. Breaks. Well, Thank work you. For you. All right, second no shot reason on the to hit driver there. Let's just play the whole conventional in. 127 is that. It's uphill. Into wind a little bit. Hmm. That's my best guess. This one's heading left. Well, that took a good hop. That'll do for the approach. Of course, hit the fairway, right, so do this 18 that hop feet forward to go. instead of back. And we're still a little bit below average for a wedge shot, but. We, uh, we still have a putt for it. Maybe I didn't hit hard enough. No, it didn't quite get there, did it? All right, all we need no, is a little tap John. here. Let's do it. And after that hole, you are at three so under par. three under at the time. Let's see this. what we can do here on the 11th. Sharp dog leg to the left with water in play. My favorite. I actually designed a hole very similar to this. It's a par five for one of my graded courses. Okay, this but is I about put pine trees near the water away. instead of just having the water there, so that you know there's a chance you'll hit the trees and stay in play. Come on, baby, be good. This one's looking good. That's a good one. Great work. Nice approach on that one. Here we go. This putt for the bird. This is going to be an interesting putt. So far, so good. Uh, like I said, that's going to be an interesting putt. Hard. I hit 21% and it went five feet past. This one's just a five-footer. Thankfully, it's that's a pretty simple putt back up part. the hill. All right, that's going to keep you at So we're not burning the course up, but we're not and here shooting we go ourselves in the foot either. Five. So life is good so far. As opposed to life is strange. That should be a beauty. Man, I love it. Good shot. All Chance right, to get on this green shot two on the here. 12th. Oh, boy, trying to carry that bunker is going to be interesting. One thing is... Only give it a try here. If I go over, that's okay. 
Or if I go left here, it's not terrible either. Oh, that's going to be okay. This is our third shot. Not saying I'm looking forward to this chip here. I'm going to just try and spin in this one. All right, and so this one five feet. is for the birdie. Not my best, but not terrible. Uh, yes. Nice putt. That's your fourth birdie of the day. If you make putts in this game, That's you can score. Very well. We're down if to four under par. You can't putt with okay, anything. Wind's picking up a bit. We got a headwind on this mm -hmm. one. Nope. Three wood is the play. Three wood is the play for me. And this tee shot should work. And this one's about 125 yards out. Give me my gap wedge. Uh oh. That's going to take a little bit off. It's got to go. Well, it's heading in the right yep. direction. It's all right. Out there. We Looks missed hit good. it, but we still hit it pretty okay. straight. Okay, lining up so an eight, eight foot putt. Oh. Okay, let's go. This one is for par. I've actually had that'll do. And right now, you are pop up coming on. Under. And I'm trying to play. Bye. And here we go on hole number 14. Now, in this game, I've never had it like hit the cup and then go out, but I've had that happen on EA. Hmm. And it's annoying. That should be... That swing was to die for. Center green. Well, it stayed on the yeah, green, so work, we got uh, a chance. Nice approach. All right, good luck here. You've got 22 feet to go. I'm going to break quite a bit to get him here, but that's supposed to be what was out there. question is, did I play too much? Yes, oh, I did. Four feet to go. That should be in. Thank All you. All right. Solid putt. And after that hole, you will stay right there. So good job. On this so part. far. We're yeah, this it. hole's a part four. We're keeping the ball in play. Not, I mean, sometimes our timing's been way off. Well, but pretty good off the tee. I've sort of quote unquote okay, save the shots by five yards to trying go to here. compensate. All right, let's hit a ninety-five percent seven iron here. Oh, uh, depends on if it keeps going. On, Bob, yep. Right. That's a great shot. Well that'll work on the green, won't it? It will. Here we go. Drop this one for Birdie. Right that way. Question is, did I play well, enough? Heading towards the hole. I did. Well, it's in the middle. One, no comment. Okay, Trying to keep it clean. Under for your score at the moment. Oh, remember this hole, everyone? From last time. On this one. Triple bogey. There we go. I think Great we're going to be. Right. Well, well, it's not going to be bad because I hit it right in the right away. Second shot on the 16th. Five wood. High fading five wood. That's fine. It's not in the water, so we're good. <laughs> Setting up here now for our third shot. Oh, oh, it had a chance. This one's for birdie. Be good. Be good. Be good. Yes. Shaping up out here. That's birdie number six on the day. Looks like a par three on this one. Oh, this is not my favorite awful ever. Managed to get a good swing on that. That's it. 
Well, that's about what I was expecting. Nice stroke. We're on the green. Here's a putt to go to oh, seven no. under. Depends on it breaks. Oh, looks good. On, get in. Oh, what a putt! I don't know how you got that to drop. That was a work of art. John says, "Let's see a replay." Man, so let's go I'm ahead and do have that. To have another look at that shot. That was uh, interesting. Nah, that was just a uh, combination of speed and line on that one. It almost missed on that low side. Oh, we made it. And right now, you're seven under for the day. All right, so we have one more hole to go for a second Best consecutive. Best on the final hole of this one. Under. Can we make it eight under? This that should be in the fairway, in the so fairway. it should be fine. Wedge We're in. about 115 <laughs> yards away. Not a lob wedge. Probably hit this sand wedge here. Not a lot of room for air on the right there now, is there? Uh oh. Hang in there. It did. On the fringe. I mishit Seven it at the bottom. Our third shot. All right, so I add 1% here. We're on the fringe. Yeah, I got quite a bit of break up there. Nope. Short. Ooh, that's it hit 39%. Okay, let's so, put this one in the a cup. A seven and under par, yeah. Bomb over to so the two clubhouse. consecutive and at the seven end of this rounds. One, it's gonna be here seven at Hill. under par. And with that, I Pretty will good stats. leave you to your own devices. Thank you for the round. Eighty-six percent of fairways. Eighty-eight point eight nine percent greens. Just you know, the putting it puts per hole was one point five six. That's a little bit above what I'm looking for. Uh, but it was still a very good round, and I appreciate everyone for joining me for the second round. In the third round, uh, we'll switch to wind direction again. We'll turn the wind up a little bit, but we'll keep the fast and firm conditions. And I doubt I'm going to do a 7-under. If I shoot under par, it'll be a good round. So until the next round, everyone take care of yourselves, and I'll talk to you soon. Goodbye for now.